What if a terrible injury could make you better? It's happened and it's crazy. Here are a few famous cases. Hey, this is Annie for D News. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Not just a cliche, in some rare cases, traumatic injuries have been known to give their victims creative abilities that they didn't have before. It's called acquired savant syndrome. Here's a recent example. A woman from England had a bad fall that resulted in serious bruising of her brain. During her recovery time, she found that she was able to draw, like, really well. We have known for a while how head injuries can affect your personality. One early case, for example, was in 1848, when an explosion left a railway worker named Phineas Gage with a rod jammed through his skull. Miraculously, he lived another 12 years, but according to medical records, became fitful and irreverent, indulging in the grossest profanity, difficult company to put it mildly. Granted, a huge rod in your skull might make anyone a little cranky, but Gage's case was so unusual that it's influenced neuroscience ever since. But even more recently, there have been cases of injury victims acquiring savant-like powers. A guy in North Dakota had a severe concussion along with memory loss, headaches, and 35% hearing loss in one ear. But just days after the accident, he found that he gained virtuosic piano ability. He had never touched a piano in his life before that. Similarly, an orthopedic surgeon was struck by lightning while using a payphone in 1994. He recovered fully, but found he had a sudden urge to compose piano sonatas, eventually writing dozens and releasing a CD fittingly titled The Lightning Sonata. But it's not just artistic abilities that can sometimes emerge after an injury. At age 10, a man named Orlando Sorrell was hit in the head with a baseball. He never got any medical treatment, but experienced headaches. And then when the headaches went away, he found that he had a perfect calendar memory. He can remember the weather for every day since the accident, among other incredible details. It was reported that a Croatian girl woke up from a coma, unable to speak her native language, but with fluency in German, which she had been studying in school. This case hasn't been independently confirmed, but it further illustrates how mysterious language acquisition and loss can be. Now, the Reasons behind acquired savant syndrome aren't that well known, but it has to do with the brain reorganizing itself after some areas are damaged. And increasingly, these new abilities are regarded as dormant in the brain, not necessarily new. In other words, the person has always had them somewhere, but they're released after the injury to compensate for any loss. Either way, it just shows how fragile and resilient the brain can be after trauma. Have you heard of this happening to anyone you know? If so, let us know on Twitter at DNews or on Facebook at Discovery News. You can also message me on Twitter at Annie Gauss. Thanks for watching. See you next time.